All right, let's... Oh. There's the game right there. Um, yeah, let's do it. Wait, I'm confused. Let me put a seek out using uh, the U.S. dictionary. Uh, do, do, do. Yeah, that'll work. So there's the game seek. Uh, I guess you're able to accept it. Right, good luck. Okay, let's try zooming in one. Does this look okay? Yeah, this looks fine. Nice. Yeah, so earlier I had a... Oh no, I tried a lot of things to get this to fit better, but um, this fits reasonably well on the live stream. The only thing you can't see below the clock is my own name and avatar, although my avatar is just the first letter of my username. Oh. Oh. Wait. All right. Am I making up words today? I'm making up words. Great. Awesome. Uh... That's still a great letter to start with, that uh, Z there. I don't know how I knew this word. Um, so as much as they say know your twos and know your threes, sometimes knowing your fours uh, with uh, high scoring letters can be valuable. In fact, I've been briefly looking at, um, uh, what's it, Better Know a Letter by Grandmaster uh, Will Anderson. And so he's been explaining how to use uh, the more confusing tiles in the bag. One of them being um, the Z, one of them being C, and um, he does have some explanation about how to use vowels as well. Yeah, I don't know uh, how well I'm retaining everything he said. But it is interesting that some letters, like, I thought the C had some um, parallel play opportunity, and you just can't make a two-letter word um, in English with C. I did not know that. So the reason I'm rambling so much here is because I have no idea what to do with some of these tiles. Um. Oh goodness, am I forgetting? Wasn't Will going to do another, or he's considering doing another live stream? Yeah, goodness. All right, well, this is going to be the last game for today. <laughs> then we're going to head on over to um, In Parallel, part two. By all means, feel free to watch um, G.I. Joel, uh, Grandmaster Joel. I think Benjamin Joel is his full name. And uh, commentary by Grandmaster uh, Will Anderson. I will not fault you if you head on over there right now and completely forget about me, because um, how often is it that you get to see uh, the world's top players um, just playing games uh, live? Um, all right, so. <sighs> I mean, this has got to be played. I have to get rid of the J. It's preventing me from 
uh, using all my tiles, what's known as a bingo. Yeah, I better... So, in the near-impossible event that they end up doing a third in-parallel um, series thing on next Wednesday, which seems, again, impossible. I've got to put it in my calendar or something, because um, I just can't keep track of everything anymore. It actually helps to have a calendar keep track of things for you. Um, all right, we've got five vowels. So getting rid of some vowels may be a priority. That's a word I've seen on Woogles a few times here. Uh, but also it's very useful for getting rid of... Uh, well, I say that... And look at what we've drawn. So, we still have A, A, E. Alright, ooh, that's nice. Alright, now it's my task to do a five-letter word right here. It's not happening. Um, but how great would it be if I could just do that? Alright. Um, Oh man, if I had another O, I could just stick it right there. That'd be so nice. I don't. Oh, I can actually remove the cursor from the board. Nice. Um. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, well, I'm not down too much yet. It's not going to improve unless I start scoring heavily. Um, All right, so only three of those words were invalid. Uh, uh, shows that I'm really making words up today. Um, Iguana. <laughs> well, actually, I joke. Uh, yeah, that looks like my best play. There we go. We got some fun tiles now. Um, in particular, that last one. Unfortunately, we have not the greatest balance of vowels and consonants. Um. Oh, where did that get? Oh, here it got played. Very clever. Nicely done. Um. That's probably not valid. Okay. Um, 
All right, now we're talking. This is a interesting balance of letters. So, where's my bingo? Salt, sir. <laughs> Well, ER is a nice suffix. Selector. Um, yeah, if there were an open E, that would be ideal. Um, is this valid? I like this idea. All right, fine. Oh, I could go back one. There we go. There'll always be time for another bingo. Um, I mean, realistically, I might have had something there, but I just I'm not going to find it. I'm being impatient. That's because I want to watch uh, In Parallel, Part 2. Um, allele plus... A, no. This is sad. Um, I mean, Seagull is the obvious idea. Uh... Yeah, I don't think I have a bingo with this. It's having bingos surprisingly uncommon. For as much as you see um, players get it. Um, actually trying to score it in your own games is very difficult. Well, if there were an open you-know-what, we do the you know what. I don't think they're listening, but. Hmm. Wait, can we get Tetrazzini? Is that a thing? <laughs> well, that's a nice high-scoring play. Although, um, well, a T would fit there nicely. Um, mm-hmm. So we're f up by five. I don't need to open the board. Um, be nice to have an eye. Well, this is playing with fire, but uh believe we had with that was decent. Oh, okay. I have not counted on what fun opportunities I'm providing my opponent. Um, should have looked closer at what this puts on the board. Um, instead of just being excited about playing some letters. Um, yeah, that was not my brightest move. Also, you would think with this balance of tiles still in the bag, that, like, this balance would not have occurred. But, no. Uh, such is fate. Uh, 
Oh, I could have seen, like, is there something down here? Yeah. Well, that's not great. I'm just trying to find a way to use some of the heaviest tiles here. Okay, well... Uh, I guess that's fine. <laughs> oh, this is too fun. We have to do it. Alright, make my day. Show me a five, ending in that letter. And let's open up all the lanes at once. And just really have some fun. Um, it's not a smart strategy, but... Um, yeah, we're going to open this board and have some fun. Get the tiles played and then go watch in parallel. Oh, wow, that is nice. Uh... I don't suppose this is a word. Also, why am I looking to play there when I could consider here, too? Uh, what do I have? M-E-N-S could be a suffix. News could be a suffix. Uh... Swagman. No way. Nice! Just made up a bingo. We're making up words today, guys. Alright. <laughs> Does it even matter what it means? Well, maybe. Um, but yeah, men's a suffix, and swag is pretty cool, so swagman. Sure, why not? <laughs> we'll have to get a definition on this one. Uh, unfortunately, we're playing in void mode, which means I cannot benefit from a challenge. So, no bonus points to me if they challenge this, which they can't, because it's valid. But in normal play, that would be challenged. And we would look it up in the dictionary and have a good laugh over it. Um... So, yeah, that's the downside of playing with void mode, is that occasionally you'll play a valid word and not know it, and your opponent wouldn't know it. You miss out on all the excitement of having to look it up in the dictionary. Uh, just because I'm not the best player. Alright, so... That's actually a really high-scoring play because um, the W landed on the double letter tile, and we hit the triple word, so the crossplay here didn't count for that much. But yeah, hitting a triple with a heavy tile on the double letter score is pretty nice. Uh, so I don't think I have another bingo. Um, that'd be nice, though. I mean, what could it even be if there were one? I don't know. Denial. Yeah, that denies me the use of that square. Well played. All right. Um, this fork except an additional letter? I didn't think so. Okay, that, I'm trying to make up a word and it's not going well. Um, 
I don't think I have a, a 5 ending in K. If I had a C, I would have a frack, but uh, I don't, so... Um... There's a word. 31. Oh, look, we drew a letter. We drew a tile. Um, unfortunately, our balance is not great, but we could maybe figure out something. Oh, wait, is that really there? Exchange 4. Yeah, I think this is here. Uh, so where do we put that? Nowhere. It does not fit on the board. Um, Alright. So yeah, looking for bingos can sometimes be a futile effort. Um, because if there's nowhere to put it, who cares? Um, hmm. It's 27 points. Um, it's a little risky. It uses up my blank. Um, is the C already gone? Yeah. The other blanks already consumed. This is not valid. All right. Well, I'd hoped. I had high hopes. Uh, <sighs> All right. It's not a terrible play, but um, it's just not the sort of thing I want to play, because like, potentially they could have an eight-letter word ending in a C. Uh, the odds of them having it with this remaining, actually now that I think about it, are not very good, but they could have it. Um, Seahorse? No. Yeah, with this duplication, there's not going to be a bingo. That's too bad. If I had one different letter, we could spell a naughty word, right? Yeah, if we instead of this had a different letter, Definitely a naughty word to be available, but we can't get that different letter. It's not in the bag. So. Also, I don't know <laughs> if the site would accept an, an unfriendly word such as that. Um, but you never know. Alright. I'm assuming they're... Well, they can't use this. I don't think. Yeah. All right. Uh, how about this? Seven tiles in bag. And the tiles remain. There is theoretically an S in the bag, although we know my opponent must have it. Is this a word? Even if it is, that's a terrible leave. Let's not do it. Um, Uh, oh, right. I'd said if I had that letter, we'd play it. Yeah, there we go. 16 points for one letter. Hmm. 
We can maybe make this work. Um, all right. Still nowhere to... Well, if I had a bingo, it could go through one of these. More likely the C or the R. Um... Wait, does this work? The, I mean, this is not a word, but... Uh. <laughs> alright, alright. We could try it the other way around. Yeah, okay, fine. Alright, we had our fun. Um... Uh, all right, so oh, really? All right, I guess that's not valid. Um, Four tiles in bag. I think this is not a bad play. 18 points. Blocking off many of the more crazy possibilities on this board. Still trying to find a way to get... Um, well, I don't know why I want this to center file. There's one tile in the bag. Oh, so our opponent has most of these tiles. Um, so they've got some repetition going on, and they don't have any high-scoring tiles, so unless they can manage a bingo through something, um, and then this is over. All right. Uh, I just got lucky. All right, so our opponent has E E U D S. Uh, oh, deuces. All right, we still win, but. Perhaps could have finished a bit better if I'd seen that Deuces was playable. That was a well-planned maneuver there. They might have had other places, but I made that a little easier on them accidentally. Um, but no, well-played game overall. That was an exciting game and a good result. Um, so yeah, thanks to everyone for watching, and uh, go watch G.I. Joel's In Parallel. It'll be quite exciting.